We featured ninth race, top of the stretch, windblown, Ashes to Diamonds, Thunder Alley, Don't Ask Logan, American Risk, Harry G, and I'm a Looker too. They're off and uh, pacing Ashes to Diamonds. The Bear gets the first call as they race into the first turn. Thunder Alley. And from the outside, that is American Risk. Driving up now looking to take charge. They head by the opening eighth. Ashes to Diamonds gets away on the lead. Now crossing over and finding the pocket is American Risk. Windblown is at the rail third, but not for long. He's angled off and will drive after the leader. Ashes to Diamonds as they continue on past the opening quarter. And here comes Windblown. Up to look to take over, and Windblown drives on by Ashes to Diamonds and will grab the lead as they head on to the 3 eights. Ashes to Diamonds willingly gives way and will set the pocket back on the inside of third as they continue off the top turn. That's American Risk. Thunder Alley is traveling along the rail in four. Back in five is Don't Ask Logan as they round the top turn. 27-3, and three, snappy opening quarter. To the outside, here comes Don't Ask Logan starting the outer tier, followed by Harry G, and at the back is I'm a Looker 2. They continue into the lower turn on their way down to the 5 8 and they're led up front by Windblown. Ashes to Diamonds, content to follow along in the pocket. Third out the rail, that is American Risk. Don't Ask Logan tries it uncovered. Fourth, trapped at the rail is Thunder Alley in 5. Getting a second over toe from 6, that's Harry G, and I'm a Looker 2 is still at the back to half. 56 and 3 fifth seconds. And wind blown, striding out now by four as they arrive at three quarters. Back to Ashes to Diamonds, who will try to hang on to the play spot on the outside. Don't ask Logan. I'm a looker, too. Three wide from the back. They continue on past the seven eighths, and it's all wind blown, drawing clear here. I'm a looker, too, on the outside. Now on for second. Three quarters in one, 25 and two. They straighten out down the lane for the final time. Wind blown, blows them away here in the feature. On for second here. That is I'm a looker too. And the battle for the show spot, it will go to Don't Ask Logan. Mile in 154 in one fifth. Well, it's one of those cut the check at the draw type of races here in race number nine. Windblown goes away as the one to nine favorite, and Bernard McCollum drives him like one. He lets things get settled away off the gate, right lines, takes over through a quarter in 27 and three, half and 56 and three, and he's just got gears that the rest of this field just don't have. 125 and two. Um, a looker two sits at the back, comes three wide, able to rally up to be second. Don't ask Logan, toughs it out first over to be third, but it's a no doubter again here from Turo Raceway on a Friday evening over a good track. Wind blown, impressive again, returning to winning form. Give him five wins from six starts in 2021. The son of Mach 3 is going to take Bernard McCollum and the ownership group to the winner's circle here in the race nine feature.
Now back, the ninth race winner, number one, Windblown. Four-year-old Bay Gellett, three-legged son of Mach 3. Joe Badug, Polly Jr. and Sr., along with Gordon and Joanne McComb, trained and driven by Bernard McCollum. Windblown, back to his winning ways, pacing at 154 and one-fifth. 